In the Republic of India, a governor is the constitutional head of each of the 29 states. The governor is appointed by the President of India for a term of five years, and holds office at the President's pleasure. The governor is de jure head of the state government, all its executive actions are taken in the governor's name. However, the governor must act on the advice of the popularly elected Council of Ministers, headed by the Chief Minister, which thus holds de facto executive authority at the state level. The Constitution of India also empowers the governor to act upon his or her own discretion, such as the ability to appoint or dismiss a ministry, recommend president's rule, or reserve bills for the president's assent. Over the years, the exercise of these discretionary powers have given rise to conflict between the elected chief minister and the central government appointed governor. The union territories of Andaman and Nicobar, Delhi and Puducherry are headed by lieutenant governors. Since Delhi and Puducherry have a measure of self government with an elected legislature and council of ministers, the role of the lieutenant governor there is a mostly ceremonial one, akin to that of a state's governor. The other four union territories, Chandigarh, Dadra and Nagar Haveli, Daman and Diu, and Lakshadweep, are governed by an administrator. Unlike the administrators of other territories, who are drawn from the Indian Administrative Service, since 1985 the Governor of Punjab has also been the ex officio administrator of Chandigarh. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Current Governors of States. Topic. Current Lieutenant Governors and Administrators of Union Territories Topic. See also List of current Indian Chief Ministers List of current Indian Chief Justices List of current Indian Legislative Speakers List of current Indian Opposition Leaders List of female Indian governors <laughs>